my street stars rook we in here with spud boom what hey is it? young spud boom geeked up gang in the building bitch so what it mean uh what part of fort worth are you exactly from bro south side of fort worth 2208 east berry 76104 i'm from the south side of fort worth how real is it in fort worth Shit, it's boy, it's hell in Fort Worth. Niggas crazy in the bitch in Fort Worth. Fort Worth hell. You know what I'm saying? Niggas. It's whole, I done seen a lot of shit. I done done a lot of shit. I done witnessed a lot of shit. Fort Worth hell. Shit. Um, what's the beef between you and Go Yayo? How did that shit get started? That beef came from Pillow Talk. <laughs> pillow Talk. Motherfucking Pillow Talk. And they called me one day. He was like, uh, he called me on some cool shit, you know what I'm saying? But at the end of the conversation, he was like, uh, but yeah, bro, I heard you was saying, fuck me and uh, you fuck my girl and shit, woo the woo. I was like, damn, bitch, you playing, get out of my phone, you, you know what I'm saying? I'm thinking this nigga playing, so boom, uh, I laughed, but I, and he, you know what I'm saying? We hung up the phone. Boom, he called me back. He was like, bro, uh, did you say it or not, bro? Keep it gangster, goddamn. Just say it. Keep it gangster. If you said it, you said it. If you didn't, you did it. I was like, bro, if you feel like I said it, I said it, bro. You calling me on some girl shit, goddamn. And I hung up the phone. Boom, he called back. He was like, uh, he was like, yeah, where you at? Will, will you pull up right now? We can fight on uh, on this, on that. We can fight. Well, well, I was in Dallas at the moment, though, and my sister. Had, he was like, yeah. I was like, shit, I'm going to call you. I'm going to catch you in traffic. You're going to see me when you see me. Boom, that, that's how all that shit escalated. Then the nigga made the little, uh, he made his little diss song first. But a lot of people don't know just because I dropped my diss song first, it don't mean I made my shit first. His shit, he made his shit first, goddamn me. He was, goddamn me, uh, I seen a little video of him and Chucky on Facebook. They were turned up to the little diss song. The diss song didn't drop yet, though. It was a video on my little partner. He emailed, he was like, bro, what's up with you and what, uh, uh, with you and Yayo, y'all beef? And I was like, nah, why you say that? He, uh, he was like, uh, shit, uh, he got a little diss song on you. I was like, yeah, but shit, I ain't see the video. I mean, I ain't heard the song yet, so boom, I made my song. My little, uh, my sneak dissing. That's why I named it. I tied that bitch sneak dissing, nigga sneak dissing. You know what I'm saying? And shit, that shit just took off from there. Why you think uh, Low Key from Stop 6 went after Yale? Probably, I'll, I'll probably say because they probably had a similar situation. I don't know. You know what I'm saying? Probably. I don't know. Good shit. Uh, how'd you get the name Spud Boom? I got the name Spud Boom from my, my big brother, Big Spud, Free Big Spud, goddamn it, Free Kick, Kick, Free Digit, goddamn it. But Big Spud is who I got my name from. It's my big brother, my blood brother, you know what I'm saying? He from Stop Six, goddamn it. That nigga real crazy. And the boy, they know about him. Ask about him. He's Stop Six most hated, you know what I'm saying? That nigga, that is most. That nigga, there is hell, you know what I'm saying? So everybody know, they know, goddamn it. He was like, shit. You my little bro, goddamn bitch. You, you know what I'm saying? He's a ride. He's like, bitch, you look like me. All that whole ass shit. And they crazy in the bitch. So, goddamn it, he gave me the Spud name. But the streets gave me the Boom name, that Boom shit. I blessed the world with the Boom. I did that. Real shit, real shit. So, uh, tell us, that. like, what your recording process be like? You know what I'm saying? What's, what's, what's it like to be in the studio with Spud Boom, man? Shit, if you're in the studio with me, you're going to see it. All I need is a live ass beat. I need a live ass beat with some thumps and some live ass snaps or claps on. I'm beyond, cause look, a lot of niggas done been in the studio with me, look. Cause goddamn me, I just goddamn, I just go in the booth. I hear the beat, goddamn me, I hear that we got the song on top, I go in the booth, I say some shit. Just off the head, just, I, I do it all the time, I say some shit off the head. Motherfuckers that heard me, goddamn, they're like, nah, keep that, keep that, man, hell nah. I tell this nigga all the time, hell nah, I don't keep that shit, come on, bro. Come on, I tell him all the time, take all that shit off. I done did the whole song, I'm, nah, bro, take that shit off. I done, Cause it's my 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 thinking process, goddamn. Cause I don't write shit because my because of my my dyslexia and shit, goddamn. All that bullshit, my ADA, all that bullshit. You know, I'm all that shit, goddamn. So I don't write none of that shit, goddamn. That shit just be off the head. I just come with it off the head, goddamn me. So I be thinking, and my thinking probably why I'm thinking of this bar, goddamn me. I'd have been a thought of some whole other shit where I can say after this, and I'm trying to put some get put together some more shit to say with that. Cause in my mind, I think 15 ways, and within them 15 ways, I'm thinking 15 more ways. My shit just crazy. I got a crazy ass thinking process. Real shit, real shit. You, you can copy the same, but you can't copy the thinking. I can say something, but I keep going. For who real. would you uh, who would you try to gear your music towards, or if they try to categorize your music, what would you tell people about that? As you, as far as a genre, yeah, I would put it as geeked. We got our own genre. Just put that more geek music. 
there you that's go. all this good shit. And tell and tell the people who don't know, you know what I'm saying, what exactly geek music is from Spud Boom, man. Geek this, goddamn me. That geek music is you gonna hear me when I come on that bitch. It's young sport boom, I might back up with a young sport who? You know what I'm hey, saying? Some crazy hey, ass shit. You be like, hey. like, what the fuck? That what? Or oh, a skirt? You know what I'm saying? Some crazy ass ad libs. Just some geeked up shit. Or I might say some shit that'll, that'll throw you off. Like this one song I got with uh, with Mike Fresh, that case. I say, uh, she gonna, uh, I'm gonna fuck that bitch, make her walk different. She gonna suck my dick till she talk different. Just some crazy ass hey. shit. You be like, what the fuck? That's some geeked up shit. I just throw some geeked up shit into it. You know what I'm saying? The geek, this a way of life. Real shit, real shit. So uh, I know you out there making moves in the funk, man, and it's, it's definitely making moves on YouTube. Yeah, I, yeah, I, from yeah. From C to C, you know what I'm saying? Ain't nobody really came at you about no deal or nothing like that. No, not no deal. Ain't nobody really shot at me no deal. But goddamn me, uh, Mike Jones, he came at me with a business proposition, uh, cause you know he doing his money train. He was like, shit, goddamn, we can do some money train, geeked up game collaboration, shit. You know what I'm saying? We can push that shit, goddamn me, it'll get you. You know what I'm saying? Get you off the ground, you know what I'm saying? Really trying to turn me up type shit, you know what I'm saying? Cause he said nigga grinding and shit. So we I, I supposed to be doing that, the money train shit. But yeah, that's about it. Not no uh record deals or no shit like that. Not no major shit like that. Why do you think um Dallas artists, I mean Dallas don't hear a lot from Fort Worth artists? Shit, probably be I, I would say because Fort Worth niggas they make music all long, all day long. But God, it's not, it's not that many. It's not. I ain't gonna lie, it ain't that many of us that's really turned. It's a lot of us that's turned up on this music shit. It's a lot of rappers, but they don't present themselves. You know what I'm saying? They trying to get the little sound. I mean, you know what I'm saying? They trying to sound like this person or something. Goddamn me. So, but in Dallas, you know what I'm saying? Dallas, they got their own little shit. Niggas in Dallas, they gonna. I don't know. It just turned up. Dallas, it's a lot of opportunities out here. So, goddamn me, I feel like. They not gonna try listening, but shit, we done made it. We made the air listen now. We made Dallas people listen now. Shit, goddamn me. They gonna turn up. I feel like we should've been getting more attention from, you know what I'm saying? But, I don't know. I don't know. What DJs are you messing with right now in the funk? DJ Dub J, DJ Cut, uh, DJ Situation. Is he, uh, yeah, DJ Situation. DJ uh, Barry. It's a couple more DJs I can't think of right now, but yeah, I'm fucking with a lot of DJs out of my city. Oh yeah, DJ Red, I just met him at the last show I did with South Walk and Mo3. I just met that one. Uh, what producers you messing with now? Uh, oh yeah, uh, Mike Million. It's a nigga, uh, he done did some shit for, uh, for, the, South, for the South Factory, Mike Million, uh, shit. I supposed to be fucking with YDG. He a producer from uh, NPA, P.B. Long. He be fucking around with P.B. Long while he he doing his uh, Mr. Blue Benjamin that's finna drop. He did that whole one, I think, shit. I supposed to be fucking with him and a couple more producers, goddamn me. Zilla, of course. I'm gonna fuck with Zilla always. It's geeked up game. It's my number one. It's my producer, my engine. That nigga do all my shit. Nigga right here, he gonna, turn, he gonna keep me turned up. Oh, uh, how the fans been treating you? Shit, the fans, the fans, the goddamn me. It's just, fans fuck with me. Fans fuck with me. I done been in the mile. Goddamn, me little girls done stop me. Goddamn, hey, uh, can we get a picture? Goddamn, my nigga look at me like, nigga, take a picture. I fucking come on, we gonna take a picture. Goddamn, I post it on Facebook, turn them up. They post me on their Instagram and get buku lights. Goddamn, I fuck with the fans. Fans be having me turned up. Especially when I perform, the fans love that shit. Cause I'ma jump off the stage and everything. I'ma fuck with the fans. Real shit, real shit. You know, you know, Gotti made that, uh, that DM song, man. What's the craziest thing that got sent to your DM, man? Man. Facebook or whatever. Some crazy ass shit that got sent to my DM. Boy. Let me see this shit. Ah. <laughs> ah. You go. Shit. Exclusive. Some crazy <laughs> shit going on. Let me see. Boom. Twitter, 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 Instagram. What what do him be talking? He be talking about Snapchat. Oh, it be some crazy ass <laughs> shit. Snapchat, like some white girls. Man, you remember the white girls? These hoes, they uh, they send me a Snapchat. They listen to my diss. They listen to the Go Yeah Yo diss he put out on me. I'm like, oh man, this whole ass shit. The way they turned up to it though. I mean, them hoes gonna get killed. They don't know what's going. On. Some crazy shit though. They turned up to it. They then they had to. I, I bitch, I kill you. They right back now. We just playing. We like you. We just quit playing. What is y'all? That shit crazy. Fuck me up. Like damn. Yeah, it be some crazy shit going on on Snapchat. That's some wild shit there. Some wild shit. I'm talking about from some some Bel Air, Beverly Hills. I'm talking about the blonde, her blue eyed, all that shit. Ready to. I'm talking about they. They know the words. They fuck me up. Fuck me all the way up. 
there was a recent interview where Go Yayo mentioned you. What's your thoughts on that? You talking about the say cheese interview? Yeah. Shit, goddamn me. I mean, I feel like he, he he had to put me in whatever he talking about because if he did, I feel like if he didn't make that spoil boom this, he wouldn't even be turned up how he is right now. Cause goddamn that boom shit, that's me. Goddamn you, you see it, it's me. God, all that shit, everybody know. They see the imitation that's going on, all the shenanigans that's going on, nigga. But goddamn me, I feel like cause the interview was about him. Him, uh, he, well, yeah, nigga, gay wide. <laughs> that nigga gay wide. He tried to come on, bro. You can't be, the, come on, bro. Can't be boom. I'm the original boom. But goddamn me, the song was boom and uh, shit. They had uh, they tell him how he come up with the song boom and this and that. Goddamn me. And he talking about he got no. You came up with that song because you you told my partner t free T slick free my nigga my day one MVP G B nigga free T slick he coming home soon. Goddamn me. He was like, uh, my partner TC, he was like, yeah, Kyron got this song, goddamn me. That's his real, Kyron Peters. That's his real name. <laughs> hey, you talk about. He was like, uh, Kyron got this song, that whole Kyle, uh, Boom, and he made a song about you, Kyle Boom, that nigga want you to get on. I was supposed to be on the record. I know he ain't, he, he gonna swerve and down and then go about like this, but we know what's up. He was like, uh, yeah, uh, he got, he wants you to hop on this shit. I was supposed to get on the song, but you know how this street shit is. Hey, hold on, man. This nigga used to hold on. Let me say this nigga used to talk to his mama about us like we Gucci and Zaytoven. I swear to God, I'm my mama. We go to his house one day. Look, we go to his house one day. Soon as we walk in there, he say our name. His mama. Oh, so this 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 is Zilla. This who you been talking about? I'm just like, man, what the fuck? Like for real, for like another like another rap nigga that you supposed to be gangster like this, you don't supposed to do that, man. I mean, I see you supposed to acknowledge or something, give me niggas credit and all that, but nah, not like that. And then you flip it like, like I don't he know, said, fool, nigga, crazy. He said, he said uh, what he say? You try to join the team? I, no, bro, it ain't no try to join no team. You if you look at that man shit, that no more free yeah, yeah, we call it first day out shit. You gonna see his shit hood fame hashtag geek. I got a song, really, goddamn, that I'm geeking. What he's saying, geek them, you goddamn it. We were saying, because we supposed to do a, a little mixtape of uh, Hood Fame Player Game. But goddamn me, I was trying to, you know what I'm saying? To, you know what I'm saying? Being a, a real nigga to the nigga, I, I let him come in too close, and goddamn, he done got me down to the T. He, you know what I'm saying? Bro, then, nigga, he got me down to the T. They gonna see it. They gonna keep, just keep watching, keep watching his shit. Watch it. Matter of fact, I'm. Wow. Watched his old shit. Watch his old shit before he went to jail and watch the shit after. The rebirth. The boom. I blessed him with the boom. I blessed him with the boom. That's what I did. I let a nigga in too close. That what happened. Um, what artists you wanna work with? Shit. Artists, period. I wanna work with a lot of motherfuckers. Shit. The number one artist I would say I would wanna work with off top is Lil Wayne. That's my favorite motherfucker to fuck with. That nigga there. His, his thinking process is how mine is. That nigga be thinking like a motherfucker. That nigga be doing some wild shit. Uh, I fuck with South Walker. I like that nigga shit. That nigga shit be turned up. Goddamn me. Uh, Sancho Saucy, I fuck with him too. Goddamn me. Uh, what about Dallas artists? Mo3. I fuck with Mo3. That nigga, uh, goddamn me. Trap Boy Freddy. Yellow Beezy. I supposed to be fucking with C-Strugs on some shit. I like that nigga style. That nigga shit turned up. As far as uh, shit, I want to do some Young Nation shit too. That shit be turned up. I need to fuck with Young Nation on some shit. That shit that be turned up. Yeah, that's about it. As far as Dallas artists. Oh, no, no, no. It's one more nigga, that, uh, the gun music nigga. That nigga, that, that nigga shit be turned up. I seen, uh, yeah, he, ge he, ge he geeked up music. He geeked up with that, you know what I'm saying? It's that we geeked up gang, though. He geeked up music. That shit, that nigga shit turned up too, though. I like, I want to fuck with him on some shit. What makes you different from uh, all the rappers out here? Shit, what makes me different is shit, goddamn me. Spud Boom gonna continue to be Spud Boom. On my song, goddamn me, I'm very versatile. I'm not gonna say, goddamn me, I ain't gonna switch it up, but shit, I'm not gonna change. I'm not gonna, I'm gonna be, goddamn, my music gonna still be, I ain't, you ain't gonna hear no shit. Like, this nigga done went rock star. This nigga on some crazies now. Nah, you're not gonna, I'm not going pop or none of this shit. I'm gonna keep it geek. I'm gonna keep, I'm gonna stay with this geeked up shit. God damn me, I think that's what's, cause I feel like a lot of artists, they be switching their shit up too much. God damn me, just stick with what you know. Don't try to, you know what I'm saying? It's good to uh, expand your horizons, but God damn me, when you go all the way out to, nah, you tripping. Yeah, they be knowing when they, yeah. 
I think that's yeah. Hell yeah. Let me talk, let me talk. Um, how can the fans and anybody or you know, artists for features, you know, be wanna you know sign you, how they get in contact with you? Spoil boom booking. My uh my email, my Gmail, spoil boom booking. Oh shit. Hey shit. God damn me. Hood Rizilla. It's crazy shit be going on. We yeah, got Spoil Boom booking on God damn me. Twitter, One Spoil Boom. Instagram at One Spoil Boom. God damn me. A lot of shit, yeah. Spoil Boom. Spoil Boom booking at gmail.com. Yeah, talk. Yeah. Real life street stars. Spoil Boom.